Hi, I'm Bernie Smith, your missionary to West Africa Advanced School of Theology in Lomé, Togo. What do you do when things don't turn out as planned? Well, a few years ago, one of our graduates from the nation of Togo, that's one of the 21 countries we serve in West and Central Africa. He realized that there was a town nearby where he pastored that had no gospel witness at all. And so he wanted to start a church in that area. He sent an advanced team. They knocked on doors. They found a piece of land they could rent. They built a platform, brought in electricity and lights and a sound system, did everything the right way. The first night of the service, everybody came from the village and they had a wonderful service until the end when the time came to ask for people to commit their lives to Christ, no one responded. This went on day after day. This is very unusual for Togo right now. And this went on for two weeks before the pastor was praying one evening before the service was to begin. And he noticed a snake coming in from the darkness in, right in front of the platform. Now being a good African man, he grabbed the nearest machete and went after the snake. But before he could get to the snake, a few villagers jumped up and got in between him and the snake and said, no, no, pastor, you can't kill that one. That's one of our local gods. Anyone who kills that snake will surely die. Well, this pastor wasn't going to bow to any local gods because he served the king of kings. He pushed the people aside and he t killed the snake. When he did, everyone ran away in fear, but they came back with their neighbors because everyone wanted to see if the pastor was going to die that night. Well, they had a service just as usual. The pastor preached the gospel about the power of Jesus Christ being stronger than any other spiritual power. And that night, with the God of that village dead right in front of the platform, many people gave their lives to Christ. And there's a church there to this day reaching their community with the hope of the gospel. So what do you do when things don't turn out as planned? Sometimes you just have to take on a local God and preach the gospel and see that God has a plan.